Hi guys! Finally we have beautiful weather and finally we can fly. It was a long time since I, did, I flew a little bit yesterday and the day before, but, but uh, we can do the video with the Odyssey, which is now not 14 and a half kilograms, but 11.3 kilograms takeoff weight, which is amazing. We are still flying on Leon batteries. I have them in the pocket because the day is sunny, but it's really cold. So I don't want them to, to get cold before the flight. I changed almost everything. The landing gear, the servos, uh, I stripped the, the framing inside. I really saved on every possible thing in the Odyssey to have less weight. I still have one idea to try, is to fly on the smaller pack of graphene batteries not LiPos, but graphene batteries. So it would be 16S4000. It would be still almost one kilo lighter, but it will be a next video. In this video, uh, we are flying on uh, Leon batteries as previously on the smaller drive. This is Jetfan 120. So the plane is gonna be a little bit slower, but not much, you will see. But it will fly much, much easier with this weight. It's very hard to stall the Odyssey. It's super easy to take off. It's super easy to land. Uh, and it's still some thrilling performance. Uh, at take, a takeoff, we have seven kilowatts, uh, about 11 kilograms of thrust. So it's one to one. So the vertical is really good. Uh, of course, during the flight, it drops gradually because this is Leon batteries. So Leon batteries has a voltage sag, but uh, the trade-off is very long flight because on the on this setup I flew yesterday 10 minutes. So very exciting. Uh, I think it's enough talking. Let's fly. we could climb up a little bit to try the top speed first with full battery so climbing okay my motor is a little bit uh, loaded too much it's overpowered so I have to cool it down from time to time let's check the altitude 272 meters Altitude. 313 meters. Okay. So let's go. Top speed. Check the top speed. 284 kilometers per hour. This is half throttle and it flies beautifully on half throttle. Let's try, try slow flash, slow flight.
Deploying full flaps. Flaps full. 148 kilometers per hour. 106 kilometers per hour. 77 kilometers per hour. 74 kilometers per hour. 70 kilometers per hour. 66 kilometers per hour. Yesterday I tried it with a higher altitude and I didn't stall till 37 kilometers per hour. Unbelievable. Let's check the battery. We have 6,000 milliampere hours to use. 5,094 milliamp hours. Okay, so 1,000 to go. say it's so nimble, so easy to fly. It feels so fresh, very nice. Easier than the Black Horse Vipers. Very nice. 6,000 milliamp hours. Okay, we have to approach landing. I still have 2,000 milliampere hours in the battery, but I always keep it as a reserve. Gear down. Flaps full, 129 kilometers per hour, 6,255 milliamp hours, 107 kilometers per hour, 67 kilometers per hour, 67 kilometers per hour, 57 kilometers per hour, fast and flat. Okay, so the flight data is six and a half million per hours six and a half ampere hours used from the 8000 battery the top speed was 284 kilometers per hour 284 kilometers per hour with diving with the level flight it's about to to 30 to 40 kilometers per hour which is 1604 milliamp hours which is nice uh, let's check the maximum altitude 358 meters 358 meters uh, the maximum power draw was 134 amps at takeoff with 7.1 kilowatts at takeoff, which is nice. Uh, and maximum G force on the turn was half a G, 0 .1, 0 0.5 G, so not so much. Okay, and important information we were flying hard, a lot of full power, it was six and a half minutes flight. But if I manage my throttle stick, then it's 10 minutes easily. So in total, I am very happy. This was, of course, 16S, two parallel uh, Leon battery, the Samsung 40T. And of course, all the description of the gear and the components of the Odyssey will be under the video. So you're welcome to read it. And we still have one battery to fly. So we prepare for another flight. Okay, so second flight taking off. Let's climb again and we try to score some more speed this time. Try to climb real high. Okay, cooling down the water. 56 amps, 3,046 watts, 2,859 watts, 52 amps, 284 meters, 322 meters.
turning back and let's take some speed. Super slow with flaps. Flaps full 148 kilometers per hour, 93 kilometers per hour, 80 kilometers per hour, 80 kilometers per hour, 76 kilometers per hour, fast and flat. And we go up. lighter than it really is. To, to cool down, slow speed, going slow. Yesterday I flew one flight using between 600 watts to 2000 watts, and, I, and it flew beautiful. Okay. Gear down. High rate. High gyro rates. Flaps full 115 kilometers per hour. 77 kilometers per hour. 77 kilometers per hour. 63 kilometers per hour. 6,163 hours. 64 kilometers per hour. 40 kilometers per hour. Fast and flat. So guys, uh, quickly flight data. We had uh, 131 abs, amps at takeoff, 6.9 kilowatts at takeoff, which is nice because it gives me more than 10 kilograms of thrust. Super nice. Again, six and a half minutes flight, which is good. Uh, six and a half thousand used out of 8,000 from the battery, 16S battery. Top speed was 301 kilometers per hour. 
first time I broke on this motor on this setup 300 kilometers per hour. Very nice. 301 kilometers per hour. Yes, very nice. Okay, uh, altimeter top uh, top height 390 meters, 392 meters, and we had the uh, little descent, like uh, quite steep dive, but it was nice. And the G-force maximum G-force was 0.6. I think it was there at the face of the forest because I had to turn hard. Very exciting flight. As you could see, I could really slow down for the landing and I could even slow down more because I tried it yesterday. So it's very easy to land, very easy to take off, very easy to fly. It's very forgiving. It doesn't stall. This Odyssey is very extremely forgiving for, for low speed turns. So it's safe. So if you think about buying a bigger jet, definitely go for it. And if you want to build a super fast jet approaching 400 kilometers per hour, then definitely go for the Jetfan 130 because it's capable. But if you want to build a light plane uh, like this setup now, then go for the Jetfan 120, which is much lighter, but still very nimble and still strong enough to reach 300 kilometers per hour. So I hope you enjoyed. I enjoyed a lot and I hope to see you next time.